how do you work th two, three, four years on a show and have it open and close a week later? Uh, naturally, you feel rotten. But how do you do, how do you get over that? Well, you tell, you rationalize, you say everybody has flops. The greatest have flops. So it goes to the territory. And the other thing you do is you say, well, I won't make those mistakes again. So you, you, you make different mistakes. Yeah, there's always new mistakes to be made. <laughs> right. It's a bit like a grieving process too, oh, yeah. isn't it? You sort very of have much, to... Very much. Now, with Birdie, <laughs> which opened recently, as you know, we got some good reviews and got some bad reviews. It's doing well, by the way, I'm happy to say. But I was sitting in my study, where we were before, two days after, and my wife and I were sitting there, and both feeling very, very disconsolate because of one particularly nasty review. Nasty almost to the point of vicious, I thought. Mm -hmm. And then, I looked at my wife and I said, you know, that nasty reviewer isn't going to cut, come here and cut down my dogwood tree. Right. And he's not going to come here at 5 o'clock and take my martini out of my hand. Mm -hmm. So he didn't like the show, but I'm still living. I'm Life still here. On. Life goes on. 